After a fight in court, newly released court documents reveal key pieces of evidence in the case of two teen girls found dead in Delphi, Indiana. WDRB's Conroy Deluge takes us through what police say ties the suspect to their murders. Conroy. This eight page document, the probable cause affidavit was unsealed today. Prosecutors fought to keep these details secret, but a judge ultimately allowed a redacted version to be released in it. The state outlines its case against Richard Allen, the man charged with the murders of Abby Williams and Libby German. The affidavit reads that investigators recovered cell phone video captured by one of the victims on February 13, 2017. In that video, Williams and German were walking on a bridge when one of them said gun. Moments later, a man wearing a dark jacket and jeans told him, guys, down the hill. Their bodies were found the next day, and in between them, an unfired bullet. Police found their clothes in a creek nearby. Three girls who also walked on a trail near the bridge that day told investigators they saw a, quote, kind of creepy man with a similar description to the man seen in that cell phone video. Another witness told police they saw a man wearing a blue jacket and blue jeans, muddy and bloody. An officer documented that Richard Allen was on the trail that day and citing the evidence from photographs and witness statements in October of this year, police searched Allen's home and recovered a gun. Testing showed the unfired bullet found in between the bodies cycled through Allen's pistol. I've always said that I would be screaming on the rooftops, but we're not. It's, it's sad. Coming up at 11, how Allen's attorneys are making their case to move any potential trial out of Carroll County. Conroy Deluche, WDRB News. Conroy.